hard as your convenience. This is where we find out if we're gonna we're, we can launch or not. All right, everybody, we are going into loop check. This is the zero dB run. It will be fun. It's nice that we have it built and everything, but if we can't launch it, then it's just a nice science project. The speakers are there to simulate the acoustic environment of a launch inside the actual rocket. So the engines will produce a lot of sound and induce vibration onto the spacecraft, and that's what we're trying to test. We're trying to test it at levels higher than it would experience on the rocket, so we're sure that it'll survive on launch. We chose to use DFAT, the direct field acoustic testing, versus a couple of options that we had. The original plan was uh, going to use vibration testing because sound is essentially a vibration. It induces loads on the vehicle um, that, that look like vibration. So one of the ways you can test it is you can shake it. What we learned was that any way we would have shook the vehicle would have probably created more loads than we would like in some areas and not enough loads in other areas. The best test is an acoustic test where you're actually simulating the acoustics you see in launch. Clear will be given at the end of the test. That is all. So we started doing this uh, almost 20 years ago and it's come a long way in the past 20 years. Now it's, it's gotten to be a pretty popular um, method, alternate method of doing acoustic testing for aerospace equipment in general and satellites in particular. Check for our first test of the day. Okay, the, the acoustic test simulates the launch environment when the rocket is fired. Uh, it creates a tremendous amount of noise and that noise is reflected up to the payload and the payload experiences vibration because of the pressure fluctuations on the outside of the fairing. So this test um, does an artificial replication of that environment to make sure that the satellite will survive once it's launched. One of the bigger benefits here is a uh, transportation risk. So if we leave it in place, we, we just had to roll it out from the clean room and we put it out here and we come set up the speakers around it as opposed to shipping it across the country. And then there's also schedule. So we saved a lot on schedule and I believe it's also low cost compared to the other option. So it was cheaper, faster, and lower risk. Test complete, all clear in the high bay. Test complete, thank you.